I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work. For you, I will create the tools of a master assassin. No! This cannot happen now the tank of whale oil's run out. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. Oil's unstable. When it explodes, there is a terrible mess. Everyone in the city knows your face, but this mask will bring you terror to them. If you just hold still, fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? Send the lens out of alignment. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make for you. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Sleep well. Hello, Corvo. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? The Empress is dead, her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city, and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this I have chosen you, and drawn you into the void. I am the Outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world, great forces that men call magic. And now, these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power. My gift to you. Come find me.
days that follow, your trials will be great, Corvo. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this, the heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another rune. How you use what I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. And now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest. Dunwall citizens, be advised, the river crust infestation spread down river as far as the river mouth and flooded districts. Do not attempt to approach or destroy a river crust. Any items recovered from doing so are considered state property. Someone in the basements below, Hound feels Hound, and the money changes hands.
Attention Dunwall citizens. Do not attempt to house or care for a friend or family member who shows signs of blood on their face and chest area. The only way to help them is to bring them to the city watch. They will be taken to the flooded district for treatment. Well, let's get down to it. First off, I know that assassination is dark business. But sometimes, good men have to do bad things to make the world right. Our purpose is clear. We want to restore Her Majesty's line by finding and putting Emily Caldwin on the throne. To those ends, we'll hide, act in shadow, take them apart, piece by piece. Tonight, High Overseer Camel dies by your hand. It won't be easy. He's protected by his overseers, an army of religious zealots. But if anyone can do it, you can. Your exploits are legendary. Campbell carries a private journal. Once you've eliminated him, get the journal, because we think it contains Emily's location. Recovering her is obviously critical, assuming she's alive. That's the gist of it. Remember our cause and strike true. We're counting on you. Another thing. Campbell is holding a former overseer by the name of Martin. He's one of us, and if you manage to find him, give him whatever help you can. He's a master strategist, and he got caught working for our cause. It'd be good to have him back here at the Hout Pits. Glad to see you got your rest, Corvo. You'll need it. Corvo. Hello. I'm Callista. I work here for Admiral Havelock. I'm sorry to intrude on your business, but this is important. I suspect you're going to kill the High Overseer. That wretched man. There's really no reason for you to listen to me. But my uncle, Jeff Kernow, still serves as captain in the City Watch. But he's a good man, and my only family. The chatter in servant circles is that Campbell just took delivery of an exotic poison. And I think I know why. My uncle's not corruptible like the rest of them. Campbell is going to poison my uncle. Do you think you could protect him? You used to do that, right? Before you had your current profession. Before you became an assassin. Just wondering, sir, if you thought about perhaps saying Piero before venturing into the Overseer's Nest? I'd recommend going with the best gear you can get together. Ready to go? Just give the signal.
It'll be a rough trip. It used to be to go straight up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague. The other half's fighting over what's left. The City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall of light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gang territory. And there are the real odd birds living on the fringes like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. I don't know which is worse. Just take your pick. Canal's got enough uh, shit in it as it is. Towards! Attention, Dunwall citizens. Please clear the area when a motorized carriage or stilt walker approaches on state business. Be advised that such vehicles will not slow or stop to avoid citizens obstructing the way. I think the little birdies are sad today. Get back!
Attention Dunwall citizens. Following direct contact with an infected or weeping individual, you are required to remain in isolation for two continuous days. If signs of infection occur, report for transport to the flooded district. you brother I won't ask about the mask I wouldn't want my face seen either pulling a stunt like that you know what I'll return the favor come by Griff's shop that's my business well it was at one time but now I'm reduced to scavenging things from here and there as the city dies if you need anything I wouldn't mind trading for a little money maybe someday the plague will blow over and everything will go back to normal but until then it's scavenging for me. Huh? Dunwall citizens, the following businesses have been closed and impounded by the state due to contamination. Barrow's Barbershop and Surgery, the Duke and Dancer Ale House, Merritt's Printing Firm, Pennyworth's Tack and Saddle Emporium, and the Smoke Street Dice Hall. You made someone a widow, damn you!
I hear the second day is when the skin really starts to come all the way off. Is that true? Or is it the itching that really gets me? <laughs> what a sight you are in that mask. I know who you are and what you're here to do. And I can help. Unlock me and I'll buy you a drink in a couple of days. By the void, I'll buy you a hundred drinks. I have poor circulation and I seem to have forgotten my mittens, so... I'd appreciate it if you could release me, or at least go... <sighs> Feels good to stand up straight. <sighs> Thank you, Corvo. What you're here to do tonight is of the highest importance. We've got to find Emily. So kill Campbell, and make it quick. Once it's done, search his body for the journal. His notorious black book. And get out of there. Campbell is meeting with a guard named Kerr now. 
And word from my informant is that Campbell is going to poison him. Maybe you can use that to your advantage. All right, I won't be of any help here, so I'll make my own way back to the Hound Pits pub. If I see Samuel the Boatman, I'll tell him to pick you up in the backyard, behind the office of the High Overseer. May all the spirits guide you, and may our enemy's head hit the floor without you taking a scratch. seen the heretics brand used. No, it's a rare occurrence. But I did spy the face of one so branded. A former member of our order, of course. Out on a retreat, we passed through a fishing town and saw him begging. Huh? Wait, wait. Ah! Ah! Probably rats. Into everything. What's going on there? Rat! Damn you! Damn it! Someone's down! Where are you? Guards! Guards! To me! Die, idiot! By the outsider! Assassin! No! No!
for this city get any worse? Yes. I know you're here somewhere, Scott. Do not let your keen eyes wander tonight, boy. There's word of bad men about. Guard, to me! This was too easy. Not let your keen eyes wander tonight, boy. There's one. <laughs> There you are, my sick boy. That might be worth checking out. Probably the ground. Outsider. Bell has these five attributes by which he hopes to defeat the righteous. He is patient, waits every hour and every day of our lives for a moment. Huh. That might be worth checking.
myself as these marvelous shooters by which the outsider himself as these blind Is having trouble holding the side screens. A bunch of children playing games, that's all. Men will come get you when we're finished. Keep each other entertained in the meantime. I don't understand how this got so unpleasant. Oh, I agree, I agree. A whore dies and suddenly this. Will you have wine? It's a Tivian Red. Thank you. Now, to business. What would you say happened last night? To be honest, I'm not even sure. My men, your overseers, a few whores, maybe a little too much ale. One harmless prank with a runaway chicken, and ten minutes later, Trevor's Alley is a sea of blood and teeth. I almost wish I'd been there. <laughs> Take it easy there, old son. <coughs> I'm all right, Colonel. I'm down the wrong way. Now about these overseers. Who's just as guilty as my own men. But my overseers have a name to protect. I can't allow you to... Oh, oh no. This can't be happening. Who's done this? What on earth are you talking about? No time, no time. Listen, Captain. You must... Someone get over here! Now the rats can fight over your guts. Did you get caught in the lockdown last night? Six hours. 
Search the place top to bottom. And Back to the beginning. With a swill. Without Marty's free. plot of course to we break him out of Cold Ridge Prison. I am That's dead. clear enough. One time, one of the what? second core shutters. I the one man feared through And I thought I could slip He's out. Bloody mind I couldn't himself. find a way down. By the time I got back, it had snapped off, shut. Yes. I spent the rest of lockdown on a ledge. He had help, <laughs> yes. But how Maybe the outsider was watching. Betrayal goes to Martin, but Martin knows everyone. Everywhere. Come get you when we're finished. Keep each other entertained in the meantime. I don't understand how this got so unpleasant. Oh, I agree, I agree. A whore dies and suddenly this. Will you have wine? It's a Tibian Red. Thank you. Now, to business. What would you say happened last night? To be honest, I'm not even sure. My men, your overseers, a few whores, maybe a little too much ale. One harmless prank with a runaway chicken, and ten minutes later, Trevor's Alley is a sea of blood and teeth. I almost wish I'd been there. <laughs> Take it easy there, old son. I'm all right, Colonel. You're down the wrong way. Now about these overseers. You're just as guilty as my own men. But my overseers have a name to protect. I can't allow you to... No. Oh, no. This can't be happening. Who's done this? What on earth are you talking about? No time, no time. Listen carefully. You must... I instruct the Lord Regent to burn the Black Book. Understand? Burn it! What Black Book? What do you mean? Tell him. Burn them. Then die of plague, you useless incompetent. I never fight. Get in here! Yeah. 
did you get caught in the lockdown last night? Six hours. Search that to the beach. It was and nothing but the swill to we break him out of Cold Ridge prison. Of course we did. That's fine. clear enough. Did I have a court one time? The one man sat here from the shadows. Yeah. Shot. I spent the rest of lockdown out on a ledge. <laughs> Maybe the outsider was watching. Charge! Hmm? Mm -hmm. A promotion for the man who kills this one. This was too easy. Did you get caught in the lockdown last night? Six hours. Search Back that to the beginning. To bottom. It was and not. Plot will to we break him out free. of Cold Ridge Prison. Of course we did. That's Fine. clear enough. Did I have a in the court one time? The one man said he had Outs now what? Get down. Damn it, someone's down. Stop playing and hold on. Out Someone We know you're here. A body. Someone will pay for this. No, I'll find you. Damn it, someone's down. We know you're here, you bastard.
did you get caught in the lockdown last night? Six hours. Search back to the beginning. To bottom. It was not hard to, will to break him out of Cold Ridge Prison. Of we did. That's clear him. enough. Did I have a job? Court one time. The one man said here. He says bloody. <laughs> Rest of lockdown out on a ledge. <laughs> Maybe the outside. Come get you when we're finished. Keep each other entertained in the meantime. I don't understand how this got so unpleasant. Oh, I agree, I agree. A whore dies and suddenly this. Will you have wine? It's a Tivian Red. Thank you. Now, to business. What would you say happened last night? To be honest, I'm not even sure. My men, your overseers, a few whores, maybe a little too much ale. One harmless prank with a runaway chicken, and ten minutes later, Trevor's Alley is a sea of blood and teeth. I almost wish I'd been there. <laughs> Take it easy there, old son. I'm all right, Colonel. I'm down the wrong way. Now about these overseers. Who are just as guilty as my own men, if not more. But my overseers have a name to protect. I can't allow you to... Oh, oh no. This can't be happening. Who stopped this? What on earth are you talking about? No time, no time. Listen carefully. You must... I instruct the Lord Regent to burp... Who is that? Stop playing and come out at once.
Stop playing and come out at once. Yesterday she spoke of a wish to read a book. What shall I do? This is very troubling. Or you might discover small items in the house. Brand by intense heat. Or the bones of rats that were found in her bed. Hey, Corvo. It's Samuel. From the way I hear it, Campbell lived a pretty posh life. Maybe it's not my place to say. But men of the faith shouldn't live like barons. Are you ready to go? Okay, let's go. Havelock and Lord Pendleton are in the courtyard. I expect they'll want to congratulate you. He's alive. Thank you, Corvo, thank you. My uncle's a good man, and one day he'll prove it. Here. I know you did this for the right reasons, but I want you to take this as a reward. It's an old heirloom one of my aunts gave me. <laughs> 